Okay, we are back. We're gonna do the main quest now, which is Nocturne OP55 N1. Going to meet Han Hanako at Embers, wherever that is. There's a fast travel point right here. Might as well just use it. We're already at the north side of town. Can we even go any farther north? No, it just wraps around. Okay, interesting. Uh, let's go over here, which is... Hmm. Let's just go there. So we don't have a fast travel point in that area, so we'll just... TP like close by and then walk there. I'm watching a commercial. Okay, you know what? No, let's go. Let's go away. Uh this way. And then we'll call our car, or our bike. There it is. Alright, so I don't think we've been in this part of town before. Well, obviously we haven't because there's no fast travel point that we've unlocked in this area. Wait. Okay, the game is pointing in this direction. That was weird. It was pointing one way, and then it started pointing the other way. Yeah, we haven't really been here. This is downtown. And here's the Glen. Yeah, I really don't think we've been around here. Well, we'll just drive there, unlock the fast travel point. Going over here in this direction, and yeah, there's a fast travel point somewhere above us. Oh, what the hell? Where are you taking me, game? Okay, I guess we're getting off here. And I can barely see anything. Oh, fancy place. Point of no return. You reached a point of no return. When you enter the restaurant, you will be locked out of all unfinished side jobs and other activities like gigs until all your main jobs are complete. If you have any unfinished business, sell it before meeting with Hanako. Let me see this. Okay, this will have to wait then. Talk to Nyx. Like, I don't know who Nyx is. I don't know about that. You write a passage, go to the Maelstrom Ripper Dock. Box Warehouse, Ho Ho Club. Deposit the laptop. You went. I think I'm ready. Let's go. Or send it back to the main job. It's time for our final meeting. Wait, is this the end of the game already? Hmm. Well, better not be. Like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. Can you chill for two secs? We go in, we talk, we leave. That's it. Hi there. She 
emptied the place. Shit. Playing the piano, okay. Excellent. You have come. Corpo. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, B. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now... I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it. Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Uh, let's see here. Family. Ties that bind. Yes. Family. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh. Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard. It'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout. When my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Seem on edge. Something got you spooked? I don't know. Three times now that AB has flown by. Think someone might have told you? We must not get distracted. Did you bring Soul Killer? Take me for a fool. Think I'd fall for that? Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Meaning? Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. Uh, no command to sit? And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. It 
Sounds like you want to avenge dead old dad. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen. Mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Let's assume it works. Then what? You take the Arasaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Figured it as a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for Yorinobu here in Night City. Everyone must know their place, V. That is a fact my brother has never understood. I know my place, and I have no wish to change it. Know my place, too. Know exactly where I came from. Maybe, once it's all said and done, I'll find my way back there. Perhaps, if you can prove your value. Jesus, I'm gonna fucking puke. So? Don't like this at all. Sounds like you want to use me. No. I simply offer you an opportunity. Not the first to try. But what if I am the last? You cannot take that chance. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah, yeah. It's just dumb. You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. No worries. About that. You could use some air. Right now. Uh-oh. Let's go, get out of here. I warned you. What? What are you doing? What am I doing? I'm showing you what it's like to feel fucking trapped. Asked you. Warned you, but you've insisted I'm not giving a shit. Now this porcelain cunt's gonna use you in her fancy scheme. Fuck off. I haven't agreed to anything But yet. I know you still don't understand how these leeches operate. She met you face to face. She revealed her plan. She sunk her teeth deep into you. Not gonna be able to pry yourself out. I know perfectly well how they operate. You don't play ball willingly, they force you. They don't play these kind of games. Don't invite you for a meal at a restaurant with a fucking grand piano. Hey, you relax. If we stand to gain anything from anyone inside Arasaka, it's her. Maybe me. Oh. Great, you're checking out again? Uh-oh. Am I dead? What? 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 Am I? No, it's not what you think. Not yet, anyway. Easy there. Don't move just yet. Vic? You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. 
Ah, almost done stabilizing the biochip. Uh, feels like... Someone's using your head as a knife block? How... How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. Delamant was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh, wasn't completely myself. I know, and that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up, carefully. Okay, but don't expect a miracle. Ah, just slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. Something to say, Vic. Just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Take matters into my own hands? The fuck you think I've been doing? Well, whatever it is, it keeps landing you on my table. Now, see that setup over there? Uh-huh. You'll find something there that'll help you end this on your own terms. If you can manage to cross those few yards, the rest will be up to you. And you alone. On your own terms, huh? Hmm. Really subtle there, Doc. Enough, Johnny. I just gotta think about it. Need to stretch, stretch your, your noodle? noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, just in, not this in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. How loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Uh, I think I can do it. Gun Whatever and pills. Decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Take the pills. Oh, look at all of these jobs that failed. This one is still able to be completed. Wow. Wait, back to this. You know, I have plenty of guns. I don't need yours, but okay. Hey, v, I heard. Well, your thoughts. Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on, and I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. And let me guess. My aura is sputtering. Mm-hmm. Afraid so. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. He's buried there, isn't he? 
Come to think of it, I think I got a message telling me where Jackie was buried. Okay. Top floor. Top, f top floor. Okay. How do I do that? Okay, there we go. He had the same glum face. You're very weird game. Jack. This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder. Your gang Chumba's on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm -hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Ah, oh, that's more like it. Air. Okay, so he's not buried here. It's just a view. See that? Sit down. I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. Near on unachievable these days. So what... What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, I'm still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. No, not really my style. Goodbyes. You do you. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. Mm -hmm. Then you tried to kill me. Exactly what I mean. Here we are now, together, soaking in this vista of Night City. My only regret's that I won't get to see how it all ends. You're the one who rejects the only option we got left. Cooperating with monsters like them. Anything's better. I think it's worth taking a chance in Arisaka. The fuck was that? God, how are you so fucking stubborn? You inherited your finer traits. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Take Omega blockers. Also, just put all this to rest. Pills. Just hold on a minute. Need to think. I think it's worth taking a chance in Arisaka. The fuck was that? God, how are you so fucking stuck? Inherited your finer trait. This is the you same conversation. Sure. Yeah, don't be mad. Okay. Yeah, just don't freak out. Honestly, couldn't give a gnat shit. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. Could be my last ride, this. Don't work out, uh... Just wanna be there for it. 
nowhere. See you inside, Mikoshi. Johnny? Okay, just me now. Offer. I accept. You took your time. In the interim, Yorinobu has made his move. What do you mean? My brother has made me his guest at his residence in North Oak. Locked you in? Yes. His people watch over me for my safety. Think Yorinobu knows? Many things might have raised his suspicions. I do not see any other reason for him to hold me here. Sounds bad. What now? We can delay no longer. I must leave this place. I need your help to do so. Where are you? At Victor's, my ripper dock, back behind a small shop called Misty's Esoterica. I will send someone for you. They will drive you to the residence. Then we shall visit my brother together at Arasaka Tower. So perhaps this really is the final mission. Oh, we should have done a few more of these, but whatever. Is that you, V? Or... Yeah, it's me. So, what now? Waiting for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. Who do we have here, huh? It's a cat. That's Mr. Brightman. We found the poor guy in the trash behind the clinic. I think he misses Jackie. Ain't alone. Since you have to wait. Mind if I give you a reading? Sure, why not? Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil. But that isn't true either. Every minute of every day, we each become someone new. We shouldn't fear change itself, but only who we might change into. Knowing one's path is most important. I devised this layout especially for you and Johnny. Your future is his future, and vice versa. Okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. What did I get myself into? The fool. <laughs> what a surprise. Let's dig deeper to find its meaning here. The fool symbolizes the start of a journey. The announcement of something new. It's the inner child, curious of the world, but also naive and reckless. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The magician. A person of great talent and charisma. A leader. Sounds like Johnny. The card is reversed. That can mean a tendency toward addiction, mental instability. Did you shuffle the deck? Definitely Johnny. He has one great hmm. disturbance. The final cards are about your futures. The devil. Got another deck lying around. A cheerful one. This is no joke, V. An inverted devil symbolizes subjugation, losing control, aggression, evil, a power struggle. Whatever you're planning, treat this as a warning. Okay. And Johnny's? The moon. Well, that doesn't sound too bad, right? I don't know, V. The moon is mystery. Alright, that sounds like my ride. I want to get out of here. <laughs> I think that's for you. 
Wait, is that... an Arasaka stretch? That's right. But... V... They killed Jackie, and... And now you're working for them? Misty, listen. All this shit started because I decided to screw over the corp that used to sign my paychecks. If I can make things right, maybe... Just maybe things will go back to normal. I get it. They're only cards. Always open to interpretation. So, this is where Arisaka's finest technology wound up. Charming. Where's the Ripper? Telling fortunes from rat bones in the back? That's right. Matter of fact, just foretold I'd break your shit spewing jaw. Remember the last time I did that, I trust. I do. But I also recall what we spoke of that day. The construct in your head, and how it could affect decision-making. The same construct that, in its former life, detonated two nuclear warheads inside the Arasaka Tower. And now, you and this construct have volunteered to sort things out in Arasaka. Interesting coincidence, wouldn't you say? I think you might be out of line, Hellman. Hanako appointed you my chauffeur. So do your fucking job and drive me to North Oak. Yeah. Let us go. I like that. Whoa. We are almost there. Why has she not called? Who? Hanako? I fail to see what you and your sharp wits are doing here. Or why I am here. Driving master. Easy on her, all right? Damn, it's a fucking wheel. What am I? Your chauffeur? I didn't agree to this. You didn't? <laughs> Neither did hmm. I, matter of fact. So just shut up and drive. Where are we anyway? I mean, it kind of looks like Pacifica. For the fun part, the limo is Arisaka, but there will be guards past the checkpoint. Try to act natural. Or rather, just be still and calm, and this will all go smoothly. Is everything in order? No one is allowed onto the estate until. Yeah, smash his head in. Sure, why not? <laughs> Have you gone absolutely mental? Yeah. Blast it all. What now? They won't let us anywhere near her. Have to plow right through them then. Knock yourself out. You fetch Hanako, I'll sort out the AV. I am in the bedroom in the central part of the building. And us, you get the AV. But first, we must neutralize the four guards. V, is your task clear? Yep. Uh -huh. We neutralize. I will obstruct their communications so that no support arrives. <laughs> 